Hello Pisces, come on in here for your weekly reading. Welcome to Wasted Traditions Tarot. I'm Tiffany. I read intuitively, so please remember to take what resonates with you and to leave the rest. I will be using Oracle and Tarot to get a message from Spirit for you. So let's get started. I have already blessed my decks of cards. This is your reading Pisces for the week of March 10th through March 16th. I hope all is well with you, Pisces. Leave in the comments below. What takeaways did you have from last week's video? If you did not see last week's video for you, for your weekly tarot, I will link it in the cards as well as in the description below. Let's get started. Spirit, what does Pisces need to know? Do tell. This is the African Goddess Rising Oracle I'm using today. What does Pisces need to know? Okay, that one. Mm-hmm. All right, Pisces, what do we have for you on today? We have Gang Gang Sarah, Resistance. Gang Gang Sarah, Resistance. And we also have Mamie Kumba Bang, Speak Up, Pisces. Mamie Kumba Bang, Speak Up. All right, so <clears throat> with Gang Gang Sarah... And the resistance uh, oracle card we have for you. What is it you're resisting, Pisces? What truth are you resisting? Is it a personal truth? Is it a truth you've discovered and you're still resisting it? And even though, you know, I don't know, I'm feeling like it's a truth you could be resisting. And it's, it's messing with. It's messing, it's messing with your balance. It's messing with the balance of your life. You're resisting. Let, I'm going to get more clarification. What is Pisces resisting, spirit? Let's get some answers. Let's get some clarification. Spirit, what is Pisces resisting? Do tell. Okay. Three of Wands. Page of Wands. Whoa. A lot of fire. A lot of fiery energy, Pisces. All right, all right, Pisces. So, what we're getting here, we have the Three of Wands, we have the Page of Wands, and we have the Ten of Swords. So, with the Three of Wands, this is, hmm, okay, expansion. What are you resisting? Are you afraid to move on for something? Are you afraid to get big, Pisces? It's like you have an opportunity to branch out, I feel, or expand in some area of your life and you're resisting that because you don't believe you can or that you would be successful. That's what I'm feeling. And then here with the Page of Wands, Learning something new. The resistance. Learning that you are absolutely capable of branching out. You are absolutely able to expand. But the fear of the unknown is what's holding you back. And with the page of wands, it's saying, yes, this is this is a go. This is a go for you. Do not resist this and then the ten of swords mm -hmm. definitely an ending that is going to require you to expand you don't even have a choice you're going to have to work with the energy of the universe always remember pisces the universe is conspiring to see you win at all costs is what i'm getting so there's an ending coming that is going to you're going to have to go with the flow 
because you don't want to get swept up in the ties, right? You're going to have to go ahead and expand and believe that the universe has your back and you will come out on top. Do not resist this expansion. I'm still unclear on where the expansion is happening for you, Pisces. Let's try to get some more clarification from Spirit. What else does Pisces need to know about moving forward, expanding? Do tell. Six of Swords. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ooh. Seven of Swords. Wow. Okay. Four of Coins. Okay. Okay, Pisces. It's happening. The ending is coming. You can no longer hold back from this. It's going to take place. You are being guided. You are being protected with this Six of Swords energy. But you absolutely have to move on. The ending is here. You have to move on. Expand your horizons. Come out of this tumultuous situation, this unsettled situation, and move toward calmer waters. Move toward your expansion. You see all of this here. There's so much room to grow, and that's where you're headed. Go toward growth. Okay, Pisces, it's you have to move on. It's for your good. It's for your best self. And then with the Seven of Swords, the reason I'm feeling you have to move on because you are resisting the lies that have been told to you. You know they were lies. You know they're not true. Um, you don't want to believe you've been lied to. Why would you lie to me is what I hear you saying, Pisces. You never have to lie to me, but you're resisting the fact that this person absolutely lied and continues to lie and you have to move on. And and I feel like what is holding you back from expansion, what is holding you back from moving forward is you feel like you haven't put everything in place. Like you don't have all the pieces in place in order to be able to move forward, right? That's what I'm getting for you, Pisces. Like I don't have all the pieces to the play, and so I can't move forward yet. Yes, you can, because the universe will provide. The universe will provide. You're, you're resisting the expansion because you don't feel like you have enough money. You don't feel like you have enough resources or something along those lines. Now, when it comes to Mamie Kumba Bang, speak up. Absolutely. You absolutely have to speak up. We have the Seven of Wands, the Ace of Wands, so much fire in your reading, so much you can manifest, and then we have Temperance, all right, with the Seven of Wands, this is telling you, Pisces, hold your position, stay determined, Continue to stand on what you believe in. Don't let anyone insert their beliefs into your life. You have to believe and do what works for you and how you live your life, right? You have to speak up. Speak up. When someone's trying to insert their opinion in your life, speak up and say, I'm glad that works for you. Unfortunately, that's not going to work for me. You have to speak up. And then you have the Ace of Wands. It's absolutely a time for a new beginning, a time to move on. This is for you, Pisces. It's your time. New beginnings, manifest the life you want. You are the magician of your life. You create the life you want. And here is your new start. It's time to move on. This is over. It's time to move on. It's time to expand. You have everything you need to get it done. Okay? And then we have the temperance card. Absolutely. You will definitely need to balance your emotions. Because balance your emotions with your mental chatter. Because your mind will have you fooled in thinking you can't. But you know in your heart, 
Yes, I can. And it's up to you to decide between the two which one you're going to believe. And you must go with your feelings because your mind will play tricks on you, Pisces. Right? Find that harmonious balance between your emotions and your thoughts. Okay? All right. Let's get a little bit more here for Pisces. Knight of Coins, which is Knight of Pentacles. Nine of Cups. And the Empress. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So with standing your ground, right? Speaking up for yourself. This is telling me to share with you, Pisces, that you are absolutely going to be going, if you haven't already started the process, in the right direction. Continue to work hard. Continue to be determined. Don't let the mind chatter fool you into thinking you're not ready to expand because you absolutely are. It will take hard work, but you have the ability to do this. Slow and steady wins the race. It's no rush to get to your new expansion and to your fullest capacity, but one foot in front of the other Pisces is what is necessary for your expansion to begin, right? And then we have the Nine of Cups. So much joy, so much fulfillment. When you believe what your heart is telling you, so much contentment and happiness is yours for the asking. Not even that. It's yours for the taking, Pisces. That's what Spirit is telling you here with this Nine of Cups. Absolutely, right? You will be you will be satisfied. Your emotions will come back into balance yet again, right? Because you decide to speak up for yourself to others as well as speak up to yourself for yourself with against your own mental disturbances and chatters and lies that you're not able to do this. You absolutely are. And then you have the empress, okay? This is a new world for you, right? Your expansion creates a whole new world for you, Pisces. That is beautiful. You you might not have the full picture just yet on what to do, what to do in every step, but you have those first two three steps already planned out. Start walking because it will be revealed to you, Pisces. The next step and the next step and the next step that you take. That plan will begin to unfold as you move forward. You will find satisfaction in what you're doing. You will find freedom in your expansion because you decided to put one foot in front of the other and you decide to speak up. No longer resisting what you know is true. No longer listening to the lies that are in your mind but believing what you feel in your heart. Okay, Pisces, you made it to the end of the video. That means that you are powerful. And I hope that you have found this to be helpful and useful and it has resonated with you in some form or fashion. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Click the notification bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos that I have for you. I will see you soon. Until then, bye-bye.